20th president of the United States was James Garfield, another Republican. That's him. Guy had a really great beard. All the presidents from Grant to Roosevelt actually had beards. See, the thing about Garfield is he was really smart. He knew a ton of languages, and in fact, he was ambidextrous and he could write in both Greek and Latin at the same time with different hands. He wrote a proof applying the Pythagorean theorem to trapezoids, and he campaigned in both English and German. He even once solved a debt crisis without the intervention of Congress. On that note, he's a very opinionated guy. He was against paper money, lobbied for universal education for black people, and uh, sort of illegally granted people lots of favors. Unfortunately, that was kind of his undoing. He appointed a lot of his friends and allies into jobs within the government. There's this pretty unstable guy named Charles Guiteau that thought that he won the presidency for Garfield. So he thought, this guy should be giving me a job, and shot him. But he was fine, Garfield would have survived. He did for 80 more days, but the doctors were terrible. They poked around to find the bullet with unsanitized equipment, and that led to his death. He only lasted 200 days, which is the shortest of any president other than Harrison. Guy died on a Monday. Guy hated Mondays. And they never even found the bullet. That's terrible, guys. So that's Garfield. He would have been a pretty good president if he weren't killed. Throw a punch. <laughs>